to trace the source of the tsunami. Herman Fritz needs to establish a model of a devastating wave, determine its height at different points in the city, and measure how far it spread inland. I'm going to try to do some detailed surveying here, so we're going to try to get a full 3D scan. And the purpose of that is that we get a 3D space, uh, basically the LiDAR scans all the point cloud, and you can see how the wave goes through it. So you can measure how high the wave is at every given instance, and how fast the wave is moving across the, through the houses, washing away the houses, and across the street. Herman Fritz tracks the wave. After submerging the parking lot, the water penetrated deep into the city. In this mosque, which is only 100 meters from the shore, clues bear witness to its power. We have this grill here, and we see this raft of debris inside. So we know that the tsunami was at least to this height of this rack. And then up here, we see the actual primary tsunami line, which is this one right here. And we can also see in the window, if we look at the blue sky, we actually see a mud line going through there. And then we look at that over here, we also see the mud line coming around, coming around, coming around. So the tsunami is coming pretty much at the height of my head through this mosque. Um, and that's also a very difficult height already because usually uh, when the water is to this height, you cannot stand anymore. You will be uh, thrown to the ground by the water, so it can be difficult to survive.